Hi, um, it's raining outside here in Tokyo and I'm taking a taxi to the main press center. Uh, look who is working hard here in the taxi. Hello. Okay, tell us what you're doing. Uh, I'm now watching the live streaming of the Mandalay's press conference of Tatum. So why are you doing this in a taxi? Because today I will go to the badminton venue, but at the same time I have to cover the Mandalay's press conference of Tatum. Because of the pandemic, it's the first time in the Olympic history that journalists can watch the press conference on the info system on the mobile device. Alright, keep working. Okay. Um, so the pandemic is having an impact on the media operations here in Tokyo. Yes, of course. For example, after a game, if I want to talk to an athlete, I have to keep a social distance of two meters. Two meters? How can I hear them? Well, you just use a boom pole. I don't have a boom pole, but I've got other options. What else? Like a hockey stick? No. Canoe paddle? No, they are too short. What about javelin? No. Oh, the ultimate pole vault pole. What? No, I know you are kidding. But seriously, I saw one of my Chinese media friends who used a very long pole to do the interview, just like a fishing rod. Oh, a fishing rod would work. This is a long press conference. If journalists want to ask questions, they have to use a standing mic. And also, after each journalist, the staff will clean this mic for disinfection. Oh, I actually caught this on camera. Really? So how do you like your job? I think it's very important because, you know, to keep everything clean as for now, we have the coronavirus. So how many sheets do you use every day? When it comes to big conferences, it's like 20 to 30. And when it comes to small conferences, it's like 10 to 15. Wow. <laughs> Good job. Thank you. So what do you think about it? But can you clean the mic first? Of course. <laughs> 